Good afternoon. I'm in Washington today, and I just did at noon the a speech to the American Truckers Association. And I can tell you a packed house. They had, I don't know, six or 700 people there. It's an ATA convention, but it was all about natural gas uh, fuel for heavy duty trucks. And it was, it was good. Uh, Andrew Littlefair was on with me and we kind of ham and egged it. So we're the only country in the world that has gone up on production of oil. I think that's unusual. If you focus on that just a second, that's because our industry has been that good. But anyway, we, we got a lot of questions from the audience, and there is no question in my mind that natural gas is a serious, already a serious transportation fuel for heavy duty trucks. So there'll be 70, 75 stations that'll be complete by the end of this year on the interstate highways. Another 75 will be built next year. And uh, the 12, uh, the 12 liter engine will be out of uh, of Cummings uh, in the first quarter of next year. Excuse me, over in 2013. So we have everything we need. We've got the 12 liter. Uh, Cummings Westport uh, did the engine, and we have uh, we have the fueling stations, and we have them starting to uh, uh, the company starting to buy. But there's a huge arbitrage here on the price, which is $1.50 to $2 a gallon. So switching over, uh, selling a diesel, buying a, a natural gas truck is going to cost them probably $25,000 or $35,000 more to go to natural gas. But they can pay that out on the savings in the cost of fuel in probably a year or less. So anyway, we, we're on the right track, and we're, we're going to get rid of OPEC oil, I promise you. Thanks.